Hey guys, welcome to the full review of the Nexus 5 running the 5.0 Lollipop close to the final build. Of course, I will be making a video for the official one where you can see that uh, this is running the uh, final, close to the final uh, latest preview. And uh, you can see this is how it looks like. So, of course, I uh, have only one uh, home screen. And if we go here into settings, and then we scroll down to the about phone then click on the 5.0 version you can see this is lollipop if we tap it will change the color if we hold it you will get this flappy android game where you can pass your time so very great things here the easter egg pretty fun so uh, from the looks, it is uh, different than the Android L. The wallpaper, the layout is different, but of course, the notification center is the same. And that's how it looks like. We have the brightness, we have the Wi-Fi, and Bluetooth, and these quick little options. If we click on the Wi-Fi text here, it will quickly go into the settings. And otherwise, just have to you know turn it on, turn it off. Just have to click on the top. Same for all the other modes. And um, this is how the notification center look like. On the top, we have the battery percentage, the date, and the day, and the time, and the uh, your account info, and then also the settings icon here. Click, and you go into the settings. If you click here, you get some owner info. You can add more guests. You can add your information. If you go into more settings, um, you can uh, do some more stuff. Um, course then also uh, with some normal options normal previous normal Android options like font size and uh, different stuff here and uh, then also we do have the sound and notification option some basic Android stuff nothing so um, interesting then also you can see that this is the new theme and we are gonna try to scroll down that's why you can see that the black black thing here and this more this is white not like black like you see on the previous version of the Android so it's more white now and uh, you can see this is the this is the build number here LPX 13D this is the close to the final build and if you tap it a couple of times you will unlock an option called as developer options and from here you can stuff you can do mess up with different kind of stuff so of course, if you want to know how to install it and how to root it and, uh, you know, different stuff, you can just check my channel, some easy methods to do it. Um, of course, it's the camera app, which uh, is kind of like the same. But of course, uh, we do have some problems. Of course, this is not the final one, final build. You know, it, sometimes it works, sometimes it, not, it does not work. But you can see, camera is, uh, app is the same. We have the video recording lens blur, same type of settings. Just quickly record the video, tap to take photos, then stop the video. Quickly go back and uh, you can edit the picture, delete the picture, delete stuff. Same camera app than before, uh, but of course you can see that now the notification, uh, now the uh, multitasking area is also different. If you click on this multitasking button you will see that it's some preview of the previous stuff that we have on the app you can just swipe right or swipe left to close it and it's not like you know in um, in a normal form that we have seen before it is now more um, different than before and uh, you know, uh, the app drawer is also different it looks like a folder but it's not a folder it's an app drawer which is white now and uh, some very basic apps like browser and then also we do have the calculator then uh, we all have some gallery options and clock music which is the default one and then um, play store which is the latest play store version and then you can sign in with the gmail and stuff like that the download app the email the messaging app here of course there is uh, no hangouts app um, this messaging app here so uh, also we do have the contact apps you can see 
which is different than the previous app that we get we have the people app now this is na renamed to contact and uh, of course I have to sign in at the moment I'm signed out so this is the dialer this is all the new dialer look like this is the sound you can quickly add contacts you can just call it and we also do have this new buttons new triangle circle and the square so it looks pretty fine and pretty cool to me so very great um, version of the Android extremely extremely uh, changed and then before notification door and stuff like that it looks pretty good on the Nexus 5 of course it's the pure one we still have to see uh, what we, what it will look like on the S5 on the Note 4 when the update will going to be available and uh, of course I'm waiting for the offshore build because it has some bugs but still it's pretty much uh, can be used as a daily driver which I will going to use for some few days and we'll make some videos on this and uh, be sure to subscribe and I'll see you next video. Peace out.